So this is the DS Hotel. You can see from the background that the place looks pretty cool. And I do not want to turn my camera because where I am going to, you know, there's a lot of light coming in that direction. So that is how the corridor looks like. I'm on the fourth floor and the hotel is known as the DS Hotel. And, uh, you know, when you're right here, you can see, you know, how the outside looks like. When you read this place, you know, you can have a view of how Dar es Salaam looks like. I'm told there's a big airport somewhere right there. Now, let us go into my room. So this is what you see when you open your door. This is what you're going to see when you open your door. And uh, that is a beautiful bed somewhere there. I like the design, you know. We got the blanket, you know, someone might be like, okay, why are you using a blanket in Dar es Salaam? And sometimes it can be pretty cold. Sometimes it's very hot, so you have to choose which one you're going to use. So this is your bed. I think this is a, is this a five by six here? You got your towel here. You're going to have your, your bed sheet there. If you're going to use a bed sheet only. And then look at the net. That is the net. Yeah, that is the net you're going to use. You know, sometimes you can have the mosquitoes around. So, and it's pretty heavy. So if you roll it down, you know, you're going to be covered in that bed sheet. Now, let me just uh, take it back. And then right at the corner, you're going to have, you know, if you have something you need to put in that drawer. And then they got a, yeah, a mat somewhere there to step on. And then there's a working table. Yeah, I was just working on a, one, of, one of the videos here. So this is your working space. They got the telephone. If you want to speak to the reception people, there's a TV somewhere there. And then I like the fact that, uh, you know, the roof is a bit high. So you can be pretty sure of some good ventilation. Now, let me see. You know, right here in Tanzania, Kiswahili, it's commonly used. Actually, it's their language right here. So whenever you are here, be sure to hear some Swahili around. I was saying in another video, you know, sometimes I get embarrassed when I have to speak my Swahili. Let me continue to give you a room tour. Now you have your seat somewhere here. It's pretty big. That's your seat. If you're going to have a visitor, you know, you remember there's one, the working desk, and then you got this one. There's a place you can charge. There's a place you, you put your your belongings and i like it because it's uh it's big it's not just something small it's pretty big you can see there's another bulb somewhere there the place is nightly nicely lit another thing i like it's the curtain you know they got some nice curtains around here i like it this side is giving me some I've realized most uh, houses in Dar es Salaam or Mombasa, you know, most of the houses, the windows are tinted. One more thing I have come to love about the DS Hotel, you know, you can choose to, you know, there's an AC right here. Yeah, this is the AC and you can choose to have your fan on. Let's see. So the fan is working. Yo, so that is uh, your AC, it's working, it's in good condition. So when you are in DS Hotel, you know, you can choose to have the fan on. I just feel like I should stand here for some minutes because it was off so i was feeling a bit hot so you can choose to have that you can choose to have your ac 
you know the place is pretty organized okay that is the bathroom door and my friend if you are shocked you're going to be shocked you know on the size of the bathroom this thing is huge unbelievable look at that and then the door you know it's not that hollow thing so this is where you put your face towel when taking a shower it's a beautiful mirror here yeah there's a beautiful mirror here and then with a very very big sink now let me show you how the bathroom looks like look at this you know you won't believe it let me try to zoom in so you can see how wow this thing is big my friend it's big just see where i'm standing it's big i haven't seen such a huge bathroom even in the normal household so you can use this if you want to shower you can use that uh you like that one yeah the place looks nice and then let's say if uh you know after doing your uh, shit somewhere there if you want to finish up this is another shower somewhere here so my friend this thing is big and then like the times so this is hotel or rather ds hotel right here in Dar es Salaam. this is a place you know if you want to come to Dar es Salaam on a budget uh, just ensure you come to there and then uh the direction to this place you know while in town you ask for matatus that ply you know that come to temeke and then when you get to temeke you know there's a police station here you know usalama i don't know whether it's called usalama police station or what but you just tell the conductor to alight you at uh, usalama the car will proceed and right here you're going to find a ds hotel so you know somebody might be like okay then how much are the rooms and all that right here you're going to find a room at uh, you know 25 dollars not 25 dollars sorry 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 you're going to get a house at 25000 tanzanian shillings and also they go to 30000 tanzanian shillings there's a smaller one also there's a bigger one so you do not have to struggle so much just come to ds hotel right here in Dar es Salaam. you're going to pay some little amount of money and you're going to enjoy the services right here remember when you pay or rather you book the room you're also going to be given breakfast right here all right